go visit some shrines and later in the day I'm going to go finally gonna go to Shibuya. So right in front of me should be the Isatan uh, exit and then I forgot the name of the shrine but as usual I'll include it and have it written down. Uh, this is all around Shinjuku area so let's go to Isatan right now. I think it's this really fancy department store. I've seen Taylor R, the YouTuber, go to it so you'll see her there. Just kidding. So yeah, I'll go check it out right now. I want to bang my head on the low sign that you can see the ceiling is pretty low here. So the name of the shrine I'm going to is Hanazono Shrine. I believe today there is a flea market, so if I find that it will be really interesting. And right now I'm looking for exit E2. I should be paying more attention, otherwise I'm going to get lost. <laughs> oh, that way. I'm good. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> this is a better place to vlog. The ceilings are higher, there are less people. Better choice. Um, so yeah, I was saying about the time super fancy. First I went to the ground floor and it was all of the uh, beauty stuff, like the skincare, and it was way, way too fancy. I just felt like a sore thumb sticking at me. So I was like, okay, escape, I'm leaving it's a ton. And then I noticed that on the second ground floor, like B1, uh, there were a bunch of, uh, there's a little lot of food, so I saw food, basically. <laughs> And I looked around and you can buy your Christmas, you can order your Christmas cake already. There was a Christmas cake display available for the order. As I mentioned, I got some things. There were a lot of traditional sweets, which is what I was looking for. So one thing off my list. And then, um, what else? Oh yeah, I went to check out the cosmetics real fast. And they were all like, you know, luxury, um, Chanel. So you kind of get the vibe that was over there. I didn't go up to like the seventh floor. I just stayed to, I went to the second ground floor, which had the uh, skincare, B1, had the food, I'm out of breath. And then uh, first floor with the cosmetics, and then I came out. So that was it for the time. Recommend, definitely for, at least for the food. Because there was a lot more, but I just bought two little sweets and then I got out of there because I saw sushi boxes and the bento boxes and everything that was so, so amazing. So, and another thing, while I'm here, um, check your exits when you're going to anywhere in Tokyo. Because as you can see, I've been walking for a while now and if I didn't know where the exit was, I would have just been lost. I never found the shrine and got irritated, so I know that Hanazono Shrine, I believe that name is, is Exit E2, which is coming up right in front of me. So, see you in a moment again. So, he can't even see it behind me. Okay, it's gonna rain, so look, look well, look fast. Yeah. <laughs> this is Hanazono Shrine, and there's a flea market today. Sorry for the angle. I want to keep this. I mean, if I do it like that, yeah. <laughs> I want to keep my camera and myself protected at the same time, so sorry. <laughs> I just walked to. What was the name? Um, Shinjuku Gyoen. Gyoen? It's a garden, basically. Um, and it's raining. I'm not sure if it's the greatest of ideas to visit yet, yet another garden after yesterday's one. Yesterday was really cool though, I don't, I don't regret it. There you go, Shinjuku Gyoen National Garden. How much is it? Oh, oh admission fee. Oh, it's okay, it's like 200 yen. Um, yeah, that's it right behind me. Yeah, since yesterday's garden was such a success, I thought I'd try this one. But with the weather, I'm afraid I'll just get ruined 
after this I'll probably go to Shibuya anyway, so let's do this. I want to see... let me see what type of thing. Because I expect that since it's autumn uh, going on to winter, um, things like chrysanthemum beds. Will there, will there be any chrysanthemums available? English landscape garden... Um, I think I know what that looks like. Traditional uh, ja Japanese traditional garden, I will go there. There's a Japanese tea house, a bunch of Japanese tea houses. Rest areas, uh, ponds, I guess at Ike is a pond, I think. I-K-E, Ike. Yes, I think so. Let's go. Okay, so I need to go. I need to take a left and then the second right. I'm getting good at reading maps, guys. Sorry, my face is so close to you. There you go. You're protected, but I'm not. This is what I'm gonna have to cross. I really don't want to have wet shoes for the rest of the day. <laughs> I want to get on that bridge. And I paid my entry, so... <laughs> oh no... Oh. And swing... Okay, this time maybe that way. <laughs> Made it! Yes! At least you can get this view. You can walk with me on this bridge. Okay, let's just do it like this again. Won't even focus. Oh, there we go. And I'm already heading out because I do want to go to Shibuya today. It was the main goal. It's just that I noticed that I hadn't gone to this garden yet in Shinjuku. And I just, I just, I wanted to do it. I wanted to go to the temple and this garden and to Isetan, it turns out. <laughs> And uh, the main focus for today is Shin uh, Shinjuku. I am in Shinjuku. Uh, Shibuya, um, Harajuku. Since I've done a really nice garden yesterday, I've done a short one, short tour of this one today. fun to order and see things slide by. The sushi is, you know, standard standard quality. It's not handmade, not hand-rolled, but it was still good. It was still uh, tasty. 
So now, okay, I'm gonna stop here because I'm gonna have to walk into a crowd of people again because it's Shibuya, obviously. Um, right behind this wonderful, okay, you cannot see what I mean, but <laughs> these girls, wherever they are. Okay, and now I'm gonna go to Shibuya 109. I'm going to go to uh, Kurikura no Meka. Oh, I still have to show you the crossing. Uh, I haven't probably seen it up close and uh, Hachiko. This is what I'm gonna do now. You guys are just gonna be like stop talking and do things but I'm sorry it's raining it's hard to film with all these people it's not that interesting for you guys at the moment so I can only update you about my own experience of what I'm seeing and right now I'm seeing a lot of buildings a lot of people a lot of rain and a lot of stores wow so far Shinjuku and Shibuya have been most busy also it is Sunday so that could be the reason uh, I haven't been to Harajuku yet so that would be next very soon I still need to check out a few things here in Shibuya okay let's go <laughs> Okay, next location. <laughs> this is my second time crossing, the first time just following the, the crowd with all the umbrellas. I close my umbrella, it's not even raining that much, it's barely raining. I'm at the front of the crowd. I'm going to try and find a spot. So I think all the cafes around here which have a view will be filled, probably full up, so I don't know guys, but we're crossing soon, so this is your, this is your chance to experience this with me, yeah. <laughs> Are you ready? Here we go. Okay, so guys, 
I told you it was gonna close. I'd have the same thing as yesterday, except now that I've just arrived and they're closing the gates right in front of me. So not even like a few minutes, they are literally closing the gates. Ah. Um, I'm gonna have to research what my next stop is because I wanted to go here and then uh, to Yoyogi Park, which is kind of part of it. Uh, but that is a no-go. No-go, no-go. Um, I actually only have two days left in Tokyo. So I'm going to have to round up all the things I still want to do and try to do them in about two days. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I haven't even gone in uh, the Tokyo area, like the actual Tokyo area. So I guess it's the center, the Nihonbashi area. I haven't even done that. Tsukiji, Tsukiji, Tsukiji. Okay, everybody's looking at me. I'm done. I think this is the Omotesando area, and I'm gonna go down, down this street. I don't know what it is, but it was recommended on the map, so I'm gonna have a look in there. I'm going to explore this cute little road right now, and after that, I'll probably head back to Shinjuku where I stored my uh, backpack in a locker. And then I'm gonna head back to my hostel, check back in, and then I might even go to an onsen tonight. Feeling great. I'm about to have my takoyaki. There we go, and it's raining, so I'm gonna eat this fast and then move on. Let's see. Can you see them? They're dancing. I think it's called Bonito Flex. Okay. It's probably really hot. Yeah, can you see that? Okay, if my battery dies. I'll have to let you know some other way that it was delicious because it probably is. It's super hot. But super good. The reason I'm holding my camera so this far is because the street is tiny. So if I'm doing this and someone passes, it's inconvenient. Anyway, I'm gonna enjoy these. And uh, I'll put you away for now because it's really starting to rain. And my takoyaki, myself, and my camera are getting soaked. <laughs> <laughs> 